Ferrari even had to move to some type of all-wheel drive. To reach the 1,000 horsepower number, Ferrari had to add three electric engines to the Ferrari SF90 Stradale. The electric motors are powered by lithium-ion batteries. Together they total 216 horsepower. One of the three has a special functionality and is located in the back of the car. It takes the role as a motor-generated unit kinetic and is located in the back in the car next to the V8 engine. Motor-generated unit kinetic is used to convert braking power back to electricity to charge the lithium-ion batteries. It is used both as an electric generator and motor. Connected directly to the crankshaft of the petrol motor, it takes the functionality of charging the batteries and adding extra power when the combustion motor needs to accelerate. This technology is common in Formula One cars. Besides the extra power it removes the need for a starter motor on Formula One cars, removing weight and complexity from the engine. The two other engines are located in the front and have a range of just 15.5 miles and a top speed of 83 mph. The motors help too. The exterior of the Ferrari SF90 Stradale has been designed by Flavio Manzoni and his team. It is very much based on recent Ferrari supercars. We find the looks very aggressive, mainly because of the short rear end of the car. This has been done on purpose and was a requirement because of the weight distribution of the car. The cockpit has also been moved more to the front for the same reason. We like the Matrix LED lights giving the SF90 Stradale a special look. Designers also want her to keep the center of gravity point very low, that's why the rear end is also very low. We love the shut-off gurney for the added looks and aerodynamics. The interior of this SF90 is far from Spartan. Manzoni's team took a leap into the future with a curved screen in the dashboard with Touchpit and Manatino. It looks very classy, the design drives your attention to the dashboard. The instrument panel is fully digital and compassed by a 16-inch screen. The steering wheel